welcome back kids how are you so today i'm going to teach you some uh, games some mathematics games or you can say some activities so this is the website pschool.in and it is having a lot of good uh, work to do so if you are navigating this website you will get a lot of interesting things like in my previous video i explained word search uh, game and that was a really interesting game to find out the word so now here today i am going to explain sudoku sudoku is a very interesting game so if you once you start playing sudoku game you will start learning and your brain will be more sharper you will get a more memory or you can say there will be a good uh, brain activity in sudoku so i'm going to explain four class four uh, sudoku for kids so this is basically four cross four actually the sudoku is nine cross nine uh, table and that is for grown up for kids i would say this is the good start from here so in this uh, sudoku puzzles we have four cross four four cross four is nothing but you will get four rows and four columns what is rows and what is column first of all we have to understand what is rows and what is column here if you see whatever things are horizontal those are called rows so if you see here so this my mouse pointer is going this is called rows so this is there will be four rows because it is a four cross four uh, matrix so one rows one row second row and this is a third row and this is a fourth row in the same way it will have four columns and column is nothing but the vertical things so if you see one and this is a two this is a three and this is a four so this is a four cross four sudoku uh, in this four cross four sudoku is nothing but uh, you will see four columns and four rows okay and sudoku what do you mean by sudoku it means how we can achieve and how we can solve the sudoku problem in sudoku you have to remember one thing the numbers are not going to repeat across their respective rows and columns as well as their four cross four boxes so jo puzzles hoti hai sudoku ki usme jo rows hai row mein agar kabhi bhi 3 aa gaya hai jaise yahan pe agar aap dekhein you can see here we have 3 here so you cannot put 3 in these two empty boxes okay along with that you cannot put 3 along with these columns also okay so this is all about sudoku so it should not repeat across first of first rule is it should not repeat the number again as per their row and column okay the third rule is in this box if it is a 4 cross 4 there will be four boxes so if you see this is a one box and this is a second box and this is a third box and this is a fourth box okay so in this particular box also number should not repeat agar yahan pe 3 aur 4 already likha hua hai to in do jo empty box hai these two empty box should not contain 3 or 4 it should contain other numbers okay in the same way if you see this 4 cross 4 one 1 and 2 is already there so we cannot put 1 and 2 in these two boxes but we have to put one uh, 3 or 4 in these two boxes in such a way it should not repeat in their respective rows and column hope you understand now we will start playing this game okay so we will start from this first box okay in this first box if you see we have four uh, boxes 1 2 3 4 and in these four boxes we already have two numbers 3 and 4 so if 3 and 4 are already there so what number will come here in this these two empty places so there are number 1 and 2 are missing in these two four boxes so either we can put 1 or 2 here in this box or in this box so we will start from 1 so we will think about it can we put 1 here no why why we cannot put 1 here because if you are going to put 1 here if you see in the same row there is a one is repeated so this is the region we cannot put one here so if we cannot put one here that means we can put two here 
So once you put two here, then we can easily understand what number is left one. So simply you can put number one here. Now we will move to the next next uh, four boxes. So if you see in this uh, in the second box, we have number one and two already available, and two boxes are empty. So we can put either three or four, either three or four. Now we can start from here. Can we put three here? No. Why? Because three is already there in this row. So if we cannot put three here, that means we can put four. Now four is available here. That means this empty box will contain three. So I completed these two boxes. Okay, so now I'm going to start on this third box. In this third box, if you see, we already have three and four. So what else? What number we can put here in these two empty boxes? Either one or two, one or two. So we can see here, we can put one here, maybe, because there are two boxes empty. But can we put two here? No, we cannot put two here because two is already available. So if, if we cannot put two here, that means we can put one. And once we are putting one here, then we will put two here. So this box is also completed. Now we will move to the fourth box, the final one. One and two is already there. Remaining number is numbers are three and four so we can put three either three or four here or three or four here can we put three here yes because there is no three and there is no empty boxes so it is straightforward we can put three here even though we can put three here no we cannot put because three is already available so this is the right place for three now what number is left four now we will put four so once your puzzle is completed, Sudoku puzzle is completed, you will get this message, good job. So this is all about Sudoku. Thanks a lot, hope you understand this puzzle and next puzzle you will try by yourself. If you like this puzzle and tutorial, please like, subscribe and share with your friends and family member. Thanks a lot for watching this video.